I'm Christy McMahon. I'm here with Kailash Narayanan, R&D Manager at Agilent Technologies. We're here talking about the Agilent UXM wireless test set, just announced for 4G chipset and UE development. Kailash, tell us about the UXM. Thanks, Christy. The UXM is a completely new generation of signaling test set. It has the most highly integrated, advanced architecture that is designed to handle the current test challenges of 4G and, frankly, well beyond. The UXM was created for design validation, focused initially on LTE and LTE Advanced, but it's a multi-format capable platform and ready for much more. We're very excited about the possibilities. The UXM allows development engineers to assess their design readiness with greater confidence. It offers flexible RF performance testing of both transmitters and receivers, plus deep functional performance testing, including IP data connection, data throughput, mm. protocol logging, and handover scenarios. We know Agilent and Agilent's competitors have had test sets in this market for some time. If someone has one of these other instruments, why should they now consider Agilent's UXM? Quite simply, the UXM is perfectly positioned to address the LTE Advanced CAT6 development and rollout that is underway. For starters, it has rock-solid CAT6 bidirectional data throughput. It's really exciting. It's got 300 megabits per second in the downlink and 50 megabits per second in the uplink. The UXM has two independent 100 megahertz bandwidth RF transceivers that enable multiple cells, carrier aggregation, 4x2 MIMO, and integrated fading which can be independently controlled for each component carrier. The UXM also supports a highly flexible downlink allocation scheme and closed loop testing for very thorough receiver analysis and the ever popular Agilent X-Series measurements for transmitter test. Plus, there's tons of headroom for future possibilities. Looking at the instrument, I see that it has a huge touchscreen display. What was the motivation for that? We wanted ultimate flexibility in how we design the user interface with this new test set. There's so much more we can do with this type of display. The 15-inch touchscreen allows us to offer next-generation ease of use and to tackle most anything that the future standards might bring. The user interface also enables us to maintain the similar look and feel of our legacy test sets and other software solutions while allowing our users to see more of their measurements. Everyone seems to claim their instrument is built for the future or future-proof. Agilent makes a similar claim with the UXM. Can you stand by that? Most definitely. This is a new platform design that was built with future test sets in mind. The UXM architecture really is incredible. It was designed with modular extensibility in mind, with upgradable processors and multiple expansion slots, and has buses with multiple lanes of high-speed interconnects all adding up to a blazing fast backplane. It's ready to handle much faster data rates, higher order MIMO, and more component carriers. If you were to distill down the top contributions the UXM provides to the typical cell phone designer, what would they be? Besides helping engineers validate that their device can achieve full CAT6 data rates, what I think will be really exciting is how it will simplify their benchtop. With integrated fading and IP servers and all of the network emulation functionality, receiver and transmitter tests, they'll have a wealth of test capabilities right there inside the UXM on their bench. And the hardware is ready for so much more and is future-proof. They don't have to worry about enabling the next advancements in antenna techniques, component carriers, higher data rates. This test set is going to help them assess their designs with greater confidence now and be ready to evolve as technology changes. It sounds like an exciting new contribution for the industry. Thanks for your time today to introduce us to the UXM. It's a very exciting product, Christy. I'm glad to share it with you.